What's up, YouTube? Salvo G here, and welcome back to another Eric Clapton reaction video. This is the second time, third time, technically, I've heard Eric Clapton. First time was on a song with Ozzy, and that was years ago. And then we heard Layla, and that was also two years ago. So it's been so, so very long. We are here to check out a song called Cocaine, and this is all thanks to a VIP member over on, over on Patreon, Faye. Thank you so much for the request and supporting my channel Faye. greatly appreciated cocaine here we go all right this was originally written and recorded by jj kale and then it was popularized by eric clapton after his version was released in 77 so a year later all right this was a number one hit for jj and then um Okay, so if it was a number one hit, oh, in New Zealand, ah, okay, gotcha. I was like, well, if Eric made it popular, then that doesn't make sense that this was a number one hit. It was already popular in New Zealand. All right, number 30 on the Hot 100 for Eric did pretty good in Canada as well. It is certified silver in the UK. All right, so maybe it's not like an extremely popular song, but hey, it did get popular 30 is a very good spot all right from the album slow hand this is a fifth studio album from eric released in 77 entitled after clapton's nickname slow hand hmm slow hand produced the two hit singles lay down sally and wonderful tonight looks like those were international hits as well in this particular album landed on the two spot on the billboard 200 whoa all right Let's see what we're working with here all right cocaine we got some blues rock Ooh, that's nice that is nice to see all right let's check it out cocaine everybody here we go If you wanna get down, down on the ground. 
Uh, this is a pretty straight, straightforward song. I mean, you got bad news, you want to kick, kick them blues, cocaine. Your day is gone, you want to ride on cocaine. So it's it's very straightforward discussing um, cocaine, basically. Uh, it It is an addiction, perhaps, in the way that this person is referring to it in the lyrics. So maybe there's some underlying messages as well. But the main thing I want to note is Eric's very precise guitar playing. It's very clean, very precise and easy on the ears it's not uh like distorted or messy or anything like that it's very very clean i don't know if that's how his sound normally is but he also has this very laid back but the uh, the voice is confident it's like a laid back but um that's kind of the, the way that the song is structured it does seem pretty lazy it's not lazy that's um lazy in a sense of like chill if that's that um that makes sense i don't mean that in a negative way so his voice kind of adds to that whole message and uh, vibe from the song. And he um, he does seem like he has a nice voice. I do you remember from Layla a little bit? So maybe that's something that we can emphasize in the next song. Perhaps a song with more vocal um, performance. But I have a feeling that he's mainly known for his guitar skills. <laughs> um, so you guys, will you guys will have to let me know down below. And also the... Uh, there are elements of both rock and blues in this one, so it's it's a nice song overall. I think it's a little bit more than what like you you see on the surface, you know. So that would that would require probably a few more listens. But really, overall, it's a straightforward song about co cocaine, and it's a straightforward blues rock song with a um, really nice guitar work, cool solo. And uh, the, also the uh, the riff and the melody are very, very memorable and catchy. So that adds to it as well. So I can see the allure of this song. It's just a good song. And sometimes there's not much to it. The artist, the lyrics, and the content speak for itself. You don't really have to dig much deeper. The only thing that I'm really uh, looking like or thinking more further into is like the maybe the underlying message, which, you know, is up to interpretation perhaps but then again it like i said it is pretty straightforward so i don't know you guys let me know what you think down below in the comments this is uh an interesting song a nice blues i love a good blues slash blues rock rocker you know that i do and uh sometimes it's nice to have one of those so thanks to faye for that one appreciate it make sure you guys subscribe down below if you're new that's all i got have a good one peace